unspoken power. No one expected him to rise to the top. But when you live by your own rules, I think I was putting this up to make them much of me poor. Staying on top, just talking about wacky junk guy, is the most dangerous ambition of all. In the face of the family, I don't think I'm bigger than a bull ever forced me He defied the law. And ruled a city like no one had before. It's richer, and it's bigger, and it's more powerful than ever. The epic true saga of New York's most notorious mobster, Armand Asante, William Forsyth, and Anthony Quinn. I believe there is justice in America. He believed in the law. That good will triumph over evil. He believed in truth. But I also believe we are in the middle of an epidemic. And corruption is the disease. He believed in himself. Objection, Your Honor. This is total manipulation of a two-time loser. But he was wrong. You lost the case, didn't you? You want to do things your way? Find yourself another job. Get him. Please tell me you won't be representing Joseph Scassi. You're trying to tell me you're innocent? Everyone knows the bad things I did with my life. I did my time. The prosecution has heralded this as the mafia trial of the century. And the man on trial is a modern day godfather. I think what we have here is much simpler. Do you know what's really on trial here? A man's heritage. Since when is doing what's right worth nothing to you? Surprise. Make a choice. Can't be in bed with both of us. The power of seduction. The power of fear. Before you pass judgment on Joseph Scassi, you have to ask yourself that basic question. Is his corruption any different than mine? You don't whack the brother of a district attorney, but the brother of a two-bit hole in a fancy suit. Now, that's a different story. We're all innocent. Until proven guilty. Power of Attorney. They were the perfect couple. Happy anniversary, guys. <laughs> Until one day. He's a cheat and a liar. Ellie Lynch trusted the wrong man. Who is she? She doesn't exist. That happens to be my wife your husband is sleeping with. I have never lied to you. How much do you want? A hundred thousand dollars, Ellie. You can't raise that kind of money. No police. <laughs> Bet you. Oh, you're making a big mistake. Wait. And now... What are you trying to tell me? There's no one left to trust. Why are you doing this to me? He's been here to the house. I'm warning you. If you come near my children again, I'll kill you. Jesus. He's crazy. The whole thing's in his head. It was the only way someone like me could get to know you. If I can't get you to believe me, how can we go on? We can't. I've told the police everything. Your wife is quite a passionate lady. I will deliver the money or there's no deal. <laughs> Who do you think the real genius is here? Are you? It's me. It's bringing me! <laughs> Tamora Morrison and Mimi Rogers. <laughs> Little <laughs> White <laughs> Lies. So did they give you something to bring to me? Yeah. I got something for you. Wait, we'll go. Try to get over the shock of this so we can uh, get down to business and cooperate with each other. Somebody set me up, Seldom. Some nigga robbed me in your cab, stuck a gun in my face and took all my damn money. That's what I'm talking about. In my cab, I got to say this for you. You got guts. Guts and no brains. Probably can talk this over like John. Take your coat off. You come swinging in here like, like Tarzan, right in the middle of a sea of niggas. So, uh, can I have my husband back now? How'd you like him? In a sack or in a box? Son of a bitch, don't you touch him! There's a guy named Johnny O'Hare, okay? He's been picked up by some nigger gangsters. Johnny gets free, you get your wife back. 
If he doesn't, I'm going to put a bullet through her head. If I see anyone suspicious around, your wife will wake up in a pile of dirt. Only she won't wake up, get it? I don't really know what you're talking about. I'm not talking to you, halfway. When one person is talking, it's reasonable to assume that the party who is speaking is speaking to the other party, isn't it? You'll be exercising your God-given right to vote. However, we'll be voting the way I tell you to vote. And understood? Yeah. Understood? Yes, Shut up! Sooner or later, everybody got to go. I used to say when that is. In your case, I do. Let him go! Yeah! He shot that gun! He shot that gun! You're not gonna go yellow pants on me, are you? You gotta give this up and you gotta let her go too because they're gonna kill you! If my mother was alive, she'd cut your balls off. You know they give the death penalty now for kidnapping? Jesus Christ. What are you trying to do? Give me nightmares?